Alright guys, so for breakfast we have some eggs and bacon with some hot sauce. We also have this refrigerator bar that has 15 grams protein, so in total it's probably about like 60 grams, I'd say, all together. So, yep, I'm gonna eat this, and then we're gonna, we're gonna head to the gym, so let's go. Ugh! I was like, great breakfast, but now we're going to the gym. I'm gonna show you my top squat tips today, because I'm squatting about uh, almost 15, so I haven't done that in a while though. But we'll see how it goes. I got some knee sleeves and some straps, like I said a couple videos ago. But we're gonna do that. It's quite actually pretty well today. I'm gonna go for a three by five, three by eight with almost three plates. So we'll see how it goes, and we we'll see you guys along with me. So let's go. And also, in case you guys think the audio sounds better, it does. I did get a new camera and a mic and a nice tripod, so the videos will be a lot more quality, obviously, and then we can do a lot more stuff with this. So I'm looking forward to it. Enough talking. Let's go. But I'm scheduled for 285 for a set of like three or four today. So I'm gonna do that. Um, I'm gonna film that probably, probably from the behind angle. You will see how it goes. Okay. Second tip is to keep your back straight. So if you keep your back straight, it's more likely that you will not face a lower back or upper back injury. And a way you can prevent this is using a belt. So when you use a belt, it helps keep your back straight and stabilizes your lower back through the squat movement. So it's really huge that you invest in something like that. I've also found that when I keep my back straight, I can lift more weight. So that's another thing you can keep into consideration. Oh. Bro, it is a whopping 65 degrees outside right now. Michigan coming in clutch, boys. But I head home now and make some food. Okay, so we have some Pacific cod here and some potatoes and cayenne pepper sauce for lunch slash dinnerish or post post meal. meals. So I'm gonna eat this. Then we'll, we'll move on to the third tip. is 
so much fun. <laughs> Alright guys, my third and final would be to go exactly 90 degrees when you squat. Oh, my breath. So I ran, I ran out here, but... So when you go exactly 90 degrees, you activate your back and your quads more, which activates more muscle growth, but also you prevent injury. When you prevent injury, we all know what happens when you prevent injury, you last longer in the gym, which is the entire goal of this channel and the entire goal of your workouts in general is to last longer while in the gym. Bro, look at this behind me here. It's like so gorgeous right now. Besides all the bugs, but like the sun setting, the waters are frozen, and it's like so warm right now. It's like 70 degrees right now. It's like so beautiful. Oh, I could get used to this, but it might not last much longer. This is the next one it lasts. <laughs> Alright guys, if you did enjoy this video, make sure to drop a like and subscribe. I will see you in the next video. Bye! -bye.